The ham can be either cut julienne or you can cut paisan or square pieces. Should you have a rind on your bacon, please remove the rind. So all the bacon is approximately the same size. Capsicums. I cut my cherry tomatoes. Depends a bit how big they are, whether you just want to cut them in half or if they are bigger than that, perhaps into quarters. Cherry tomatoes cut in half. And the mushrooms which have been washed already. And here we got the finished sliced mushrooms. Shallots, spring onions, rubber bands of Check for wilted pieces. Depending on the cheese, you can influence the flavor of the quiche. You can have a tasty cheese. It is of lower quality, so the flavor is probably not as nice. If you have a Gruyere, which is quite a strong flavor, you can go for a Swiss cheese, which is a more nutty flavor. Go, a little bit of fat, not too much. So minimal amount. <laughs> to make the filling, I will have the flour on one side, the eggs on the other side. I will slowly incorporate the flour and the eggs. Not too much flour, slowly, slowly. It becomes nice and smooth and as you have more and more flour in it, it will get thicker and thicker. If it gets too thick, all you do is add a little bit more liquid. Now you have a nice smooth mixture that does not have to be strained. Nice and smooth, we add the leftover milk and our savory custard is just about done. All I need now is a pinch of nutmeg, pepper, put it on your lid, use your fingers to add the pepper. Last, your salt. You can always add more, you cannot remove. Mix it together. Let it stand. 